Pete and Rod. Today we're going to be building a conduit. I have three minutes to explain and talk because I went to five minutes last time. That's not happening again. First of all, we have changes to the base. We have more defenses. Like that's a honey thing. I'll show you from the outside. And if you go ahead and run down this hallway in like the basement or garage, whatever you want to call it. When you come up here and you're met with something. I built this. I like it. I like the design. It looks a lot, it looks a lot better from the outside. But it also looks better on the inside. So I like the best. Okay, I went on in I went on an adventure. Our nether portal is over there, the mining one, and it's like five thousand blocks in that direction. So on the way back, of course, you went into different biomes. I got sweet I gave him eleven sweet berries and let's just show you what he did with it. But first of all, I put like a honey trap. I knew this would work. I just never thought to use it. Once you get in there, your jump is decreased by like eighty percent. So you're not jumping out of there. And then sweet berries all around. Those things start to hurt. Look at my armor. My armor. Like they're destroyed. But let me show you. Like it's just gone wrong. I'm one minute in. So I should be good. But like he's done so much. He's done, he's done so much. And I've noticed it. So we have to get him back. Okay first of all he's designing a lava moat. To go around this old house. It's a work in progress as you see. And secondly, I gave him 11. This is what he does with the sweet berries. I'm just, I'm just astonished. Like, it goes all the way around his base. And you're, you're not going to have fun. But let's say you're a mob. You somehow get past the lava pit. I don't know how. Like, right now you can. But, like, after that, I don't know how. But let's say you do. If you walk through here diagonally, you're pretty much done. If you walk through here straight, you're going to be so low. A punch to the face will kill you. And anyway, even if you get through that... You're sadly stuck in here. You can't even get into the house. So you lived a pretty sad life. But if you're a creeper, I'd say you did your job. Because as soon as he comes out, you can go ahead and take out some defenses. So you did pretty good. But now let's get to the payback. Okay, first of all, I just want to say how helpful his base was in helping me prank him. Because, like, he had everything I needed. I didn't even have to leave his base. But he's spawning up in there. Oh, shoot. But he's spawning up in there, so he'll probably leave like he has a secret door. Okay, thank you. Like he has a secret door that leads all the way back here. It's like a locked door, so you have to put a special code. I don't know the code. So we're going to go ahead and trap him with a classic dispenser trap. But yeah, anyway, this is the build, the setup. So more than likely, he's going to run from, from here and all the way out. I'm about to hit the three-minute mark, so I'm just going to show you. Where I'm gonna place it, so he's gonna run through here, and boom, I'm gonna land, line him up right there. He's getting shot. He has no armor because his armor has been taken a toll by there, or by the bushes, and so he's putting it up till he gets the enchants. And then I'm not gonna put one there because he's gonna expect it. And he's gonna be like, "Is there any more?" Boom, one right there on each side, and then come through. And then as soon as you come up this ladder, boom, one right there. That should be enough to take him out. Let's go ahead and build it clip before I get to the ocean. He almost killed me like it's traps or something. I accidentally ran into here but I have like prop 4 so it only took me down 2 hearts and it took forever for me to swim. But still one last clip. Technically it was 2 but I messed up on um, the thing like it, it dispensed the arrows but it dispensed them too slow so you could just run by. But now I think I fixed the problem so let me pretend I'm sushi. Oh, what a wonderful world of Minecraft. You know what? I'm not going to go out that way. i got too many defenses. That's for, that's for King Narai to do. Why don't I go my back way? The easiest way of it. Oh, yeah, that's going to work. I mean, he's going to run. Another. And another. Ouch. Dang. Okay, so that's definitely going to work. And Oh, my God. I'm at half, I'm at half hearts. And he's going to have no armor on, so he's dead. He's just straight up dead. He's <laughs> okay, I hope this works. Let's get to the ocean. It worked. As you see, like a big sticker coming on my screen. I think I'll be able to do that. And yeah, it's been a few days and he couldn't make it. He was here. As you saw, he died to it, but it's been, it's the next day and he can't make it this early. But to prove that to you, why don't I come up here and show you a little trap I made? 
Like, it took me a while. I've become good with redstone. You run over this trip wire? Oh, nothing happens. You're fine. If I flip this lever, though, then you run over it. A lava pit opens, and if you're walking or running, you're done. I've somehow become good with redstone, because at first, if I flipped the lever, it would open. If I closed it, I always wanted it. But anyway, I finally have a, on a trap I can turn on and off. That's amazing. But let's get to the ocean. Oh, on top of that, I watched a YouTube video to make this, but if I put the secret code in, don't look at the secret code, it'll open the door. Man, it's been, it's been good. And then my defenses, I became Donald Trump and built a wall. A very, very strong wall. Hopefully strong enough to keep people out, but anyway, back to the wow. Okay, I think I'm going to put the conduit over here because that's like, this is a very good place. Just because one build didn't work and it messed up the property does not mean that this whole entire land is bad. And, and there was a cave we came out of, like, I think it, it was somewhere around here. We built a pillar, but it's somewhere, uh, yeah, right over there. So if I can build a conduit, I don't know if it reaches that far. Like if I can build a conduit somewhere around here, that will be great. So let's get to it. Also, I'm not sure at the moment. I'm pretty sure that you can use like any prismarine as long as it has the word prismarine in its thing. But I'm not sure and I could be messing this up. Look at that. Look at this beautiful misplace already. Boom. I know it's like that. Then one, two, three, four... I'm surprised I've not got attacked by drowns yet. Four. And then I should be able to build like a little ring. Boom, there we go. One, two. One, two, three, four. I haven't ran out of air nor run into drowns. That's. My luck is amazing. Mm. I even get my blocks back. But I'm really hoping this will work. I know the build will work, but I'm saying. The blocks I used, I'm pretty sure it can, but then something keeps telling me I mess. Oh my god, the trident. That's what you hit me with. Out of here, bum. Okay, two more things to place, and we finally get our first bad boy. Man, I promised adventure in my last video. This really wasn't adventurous. But we can finally put the conduit down. And then get to, I guess, the adventure. Where I'm just going to show you, like, the what this thing does. Boom. Break this. There we go. We have conduit power. This is my first conduit that I've ever built in, like, a real survival world. I love piercing on my crossbow because it literally goes through people. But I'm going to go ahead and spend some time down here and just record and then show you how bad guys feel after running into me oh that does not go far at all okay i ran into a little issue as you can see we're pretty darn close to the conduit and he's not taking damage as i just looked there and then that's when i realized i made a mistake and i have to put another layer on which at the time i did not know but now i do see i'm like what in the world is this he can't <laughs> but anyway it's finally done, and this is what it looks like. Boom, it is complete. I can conclude it does work. A couple drowns have come by and it killed them. I don't think I have that recorded. Yes, yeah, about to stop. And anyway, thanks for watching. Have a good day, and I'm out.